Iowa 24, Wisconsin 10. I thought Wisconsin would find a way to win this ball game because I did not trust Iowa's offense. I was mistaken on that. Bottom line on it. Let's uh let's scroll it down and, and you can see what we saw. Uh 68 plays on offense for Iowa. They only had one turnover. Wisconsin had three. I thought that the team that you would have an issue with turning the football over was going to be Iowa because I thought that Graham Mertz had kind of figured it out a little bit once Jim Leonard took over. And I should have lost. I, I should or not lost. I should have known that Graham Mertz will always have that in him, right? Total yards in this game, Wisconsin had 227. Iowa's offense won the game with only 146 total yards. Now, Iowa did have the one defensive touchdown. That certainly helped things out. Um, but 45 rushing attempts for Iowa on only 68 plays. Like, they they didn't do a whole lot, but they, I'll tell you this, 14 out of 23 for Spencer Petras ain't bad. That's not awful compared to what at some of the games that he's had this year. Um, Wisconsin had a better PPA per play, but Iowa, a better success rate overall. They had by 8%, by the way, 32% to 24. Better standard down success. They were able to stay ahead of the chains, and Wisconsin was not. Passing down success was negligible, even though Wisconsin, you know, had a lead there, 17 to uh, to 15%. 11 tackles for loss for the Badgers defense, six sacks in this game. Iowa had three quarterback hurries, three and a half sacks, eight and a half tackles for loss. This was a disaster as far as an offensive perspective. But when you look at what these teams were able to do, I mean, Graham Mertz with the two interceptions, just killers. Uh, 82 Atlantic jumps in. Do you think Jim Leonard keeps the head coaching job? I think they want him to have the head coaching job, but it is really tough to sell right now. Um, and he, he, you did mention Brett Bielema just lost Big Ten Coach of the Year award after the past two weeks. He still can play into it uh, because they still exceeded expectations, but I think he needed to win the Big Ten West, and I don't know that he can do that. Uh, because they have to play Michigan this coming up week. So, I mean, who knows? Um, I mean, who do you give it to in the Big Ten? Like, is it another hardball year, or do you give it to Ryan Day for, you know, maybe going undefeated if they beat Michigan? Like, I don't know. I don't know what you do. Maybe you just give it to Brian Ferentz for actually coming up with something on offense after a disastrous couple of, you know, first weeks, uh, six weeks, whatever that was. Just, uh, Just brutal. Just brutal. At this this ball game, of course, makes us uh, here. We'll move off of that game and let's talk about this. Uh, but by the way, congrats to Iowa. I mean, just uh, finding a way to get it done. They are now six and four on the season, but they are in a four way tie for first place in the Big Ten West. Four and three for Illinois. Four and three for Iowa. Four and three for Purdue. Four and three for Minnesota. Purdue has wins over Illinois and Minnesota. Uh, Illinois has a win over Iowa. And Minnesota. Purdue has a win over Illinois. Of course, uh, Iowa. Um, yeah, I mean, I think Illinois holds the majority of the tiebreakers here. But if they lose next week, then what do you get? Right? And I, I, I got to dive into this a little more. I didn't have time before the ball, or before the, uh, I was going to say before the ball game, before the show. But yeah, this is, I, I don't know what's going to end up happening. <laughs> I got no idea. Uh, but it is it's up in the air. You got two seven and three teams and you got two six and four teams. What a what a debacle. What a debacle the Big Ten West really is. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter at Gary WCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.